Military families have no greater supporter than my friend and partner, Michelle Obama. Ladies and gentlemen, the President of the United States. Our military service members, veterans and their families, shoulder the burden of protecting the entire nation. Michelle Obama and Dr. Jill Biden have joined forces with the public and private sectors, including Blue Star families, to launch a nationwide initiative called Joining Forces, which ensures that the men and women engaged in service and coming home and their loved ones have the tools required to flourish in life. A lofty goal, yes, but an obtainable one. How? Joining Forces brings attention to the unique needs and strengths of America's military families. Joining Forces inspires, educates, encourages the rest of us to assure that those who've served have the opportunities, the resources, and the support they've earned. Joining Forces showcases the skills, experience, and dedication of our service members, veterans, and their families, whose contribution then emboldens our nation's communities. Joining Forces nurtures greater connections between American civilians and our military. Michelle Obama, Jill Biden, and their colleagues give a constant and warm embrace to our soldiers, sailors, Marines, and those closest to them. I ask every American to join the embrace today. I want to thank all of you, our extraordinary men and women in uniform, and veterans, and your extraordinary families. Ladies and gentlemen, the President of the United States. Michelle Obama as the First Lady of the United States, and Jill Biden as the mom of an Army National Guardsman who served in the Iraq War, fully understand that public service means adapting to a new way of life. They know too well that returning veterans and their families need to be given the chance to achieve the happiness which all of us are guaranteed. Joining Forces has a remarkable track record of providing opportunities for our homeward-bound service members and their loved ones. Through the Military Spouse Employment Partnership, over 65,000 wives and husbands have been hired by a total of 266 employers. In April of 2014, through Joining Forces, Mrs. Obama and Dr. Biden created the Veterans Employment Center. The VEC is a comprehensive online job resource for thousands of military family members, as well as the soldiers, sailors, and Marines who are pushing the restart button on their civilian lives. Joining Forces is also an advocate on local levels. Virtually all 50 states have enacted legislation which removes credentialing impediments for separating servicemen and women. Virtually all states have passed laws expediting military spouse transition through licensure portability. Clearly more needs to be done. One of my predecessors, the laconic Calvin Coolidge, once said, the business of America is business. I say, the business of America is better than better. I want you to know that this whole country believes in you. And we've got your backs. Thank you for your service. Thank you for your sacrifice. Thank you for your unending commitment to our country. Ladies and gentlemen, the President of the United States. My fellow Americans, only an idiot doesn't see the importance of education. Fortunately, the Joining Forces team, guided by Michelle Obama and Jill Biden, understands that a child whose mother or father is serving or has served our country deserves the best education possible. Dr. Biden helped launch the VA GI Comparison Tool. Using the website, service members and their dependents can estimate each school's tuition and fees, housing allowances, and book stipends. They can also find data on graduation rates, loan defaults, median lending levels, and other indicators. Now, what happens once the child is in school? More than 100 colleges and universities have signed on to Educate the Educators, a Joining Forces program that prepares teachers to become fully engaged in the social, emotional, and academic needs of children in military families. Classrooms become more inviting, school cultures more compassionate. And of course, 
a great idea spreads. Legislatures in all 50 states have committed themselves to the Military Child Education Compact, enabling them to support military-connected students from kindergarten onward. It is a good beginning, but not enough. Thomas Jefferson often said, ipsa scientia potestas est, knowledge is power. A proper education is the cornerstone to a successful life, to thriving communities, to a vibrant nation. Those who can learn. Let's make sure everyone can. Ladies and gentlemen, the president of the Creative Coalition, Tim Daly. Health matters, I know. I played a doctor on TV for five years. Health issues are where Michelle Obama, Jill Biden, and joining forces shine. Veterans Day 2014, joining forces produced Wellness Week alongside the Association of American Medical Colleges, the Center for Deployment Psychology, the American Psychiatric Association, the American Nurses Association, and others. So what the hell did they do for seven whole days? How about this? Interactive training sessions for clinical and non-clinical professions, which were focused on health and wellness issues specific to veterans, service members, and their families. Also, last June, Michelle Obama announced the mayor's challenge to end veteran homelessness. Since then, a multitude of mayors, governors, and county execs have committed to finding housing for all veterans. Yes, all, by the end of this year. Remarkable. If we can eliminate this tragic dilemma for military personnel, this may be the key to solving homelessness in other areas as well. And so, this is no time to sit back and say, problem solved. This is the time for you, for all of us, governments, corporations, nonprofits, individuals, to figure out how we can do our part to honor our fellow Americans and their families, the men, women, and children who have sacrificed so many precious moments together. When they went overseas to fight, the heroes who make up our combat forces had one priority, our safety. Let's promise them, through word and action, that their safety and the safety of their loved ones is our priority. Join the Creative Coalition and Blue Star families to keep the tireless and outstanding work of Michelle Obama, Jill Biden, and joining forces soaring well into the future.